Lupe Zamora wants Fish and Game to give him his job back. He got fired in 2009 after reporting to state auditors how his boss accepted gift cards from a farmer leasing land from the San Jacinto Wildlife Area. Two state investigations have confirmed wrongdoing occurred. So you used to work here, right? What was your job here? I, I used to work for the Department of Fish and Game. I used to do wildlife habitat management. I used to uh, have sure that there was wetlands and uh, I used to work in the, inside the, the, the office and hunting days over uh, checking hunting license, bringing in hunters and uh, collecting their money and, and put them in a the safe. And I did that for 12 years at the Department of Fish and Game. I worked for, started with Tom Pollock in 1993 until I met Mr. Tom Sewell and I caught him uh, getting, uh, receiving gift cards of uh, $500 gift cards, uh, $800 gift cards, $400 gift cards from the farmer uh, Bill Bruno. And uh, I, re I reported to uh, Eddie Kono and Eddie Kono decided not to do anything about it. And uh, Eddie Kono knew almost the two, three months before I taught until I whistleblowed to Scott, but Eddie Kona didn't do nothing about it. And then we went to court, to union court, and uh, anyway, they they squared under oath that uh, they had right to use where it says gift cards, the two thousand, three thousand dollar gift cards. And then uh, I caught it and I reported it. Who, who, and did you, who did you report it to? I reported to Kat, her name was Cassie in Sacramento. Oh, she's with the state auditors. Board? She's a state auditor, yeah, with the whistleblowing. Okay, the State Auditor's Bureau. Yeah. Okay, and... And, and anyway, and uh, I decided, you know, to to talk to Eddie Kono. So anyway, Eddie, uh, I got called in the office, and that was in October, somewhere in October 20, somewhere in there. And, uh, Scott Sewell took my keys, my phone, my, my keys from the safe, everything, all my keys. And he told me that he, you know, that I was dismissed until further notice. Okay, so this and you, so they fired you right after you reported there was a problem with these gift cards. Yeah, they reported, and then I talked to Eddie Kono, and Eddie Kono told me that he called me in December 30th that I never, I didn't, didn't work for the Department of Fish and Game anymore. Uh, okay, and, and uh, that was for whistleblowing. Yeah. Oh, okay, and um, that was the manager, okay. region manager Eddie Kono. Okay, and um, so they, so do you think they fired? Well, they, in the personnel hearing, they said they fired you because they, you weren't doing a good job. Well, what, was that true? That was not true. I started this well out before anybody else was here. I, I started planting trees way in here. I never had one equipment in any place to fix tractors or anywhere else. You can uh, ask Mr. Tom Pollock. He's my boss for almost 11, 13 years. There was never no equipment broken or nothing from me. Okay, and um, so you think you were fired because you, you blew the whistle on the gift cards? Uh, that, uh, I was fired for whistling, yes, for blowing the whistle on the gift cards. Okay, all right. Okay. And, uh, and so, um, so what, what, what year were you fired? It was back in the 19, uh, 2009, somewhere in uh, Ju June or somewhere in there, July, somewhere in there. And so what have you been doing since then? Uh, I got injured in a job and uh, they've been working in my legs because I got uh, I got a big main line blew up in my face and in my hand, and they've been repairing my leg, and I've been in workman's comp. Okay, uh, who, who are you working for when that happened? Uh, Department of Fish and Game Center, Center Wildlife Area. Oh, okay, so so you were working temporary then? Or no, I was seasonal lay for 12, 13 years. Oh, oh, okay, but after they fired you, what have you been doing? I have not been doing nothing but just medical. For David Donelsky, this is Angel Ortiz for the Press Enterprise and PE.com.